you need to forgive your parents. Even if they have done horrible things to you, you need to forgive your parents. They may have done very perverse, bad things to you. They may have done things to really, really hurt you. You need to forgive your parents. I know for myself, I used to hate my parents so much. Now, when I was a kid, maybe not then, but maybe my teenage years and all the way up, I really, really disliked my parents, especially when I was 18. I wanted nothing to do with them ever again. So after a while, I moved out when I was 18. And the crazy thing about that, God made it a way where I had to have some type of contact with them. Yes, I may not have contacted them a lot, but in some way or form, they either contacted me or I contacted them. So there was some type of contact, even though I did not like them. And when I gave my life to God, I had to get rid of those negative feelings about my parents. And I had to move on. What someone said to me before, because I was telling this person about what happened between me and my parents, this person said to me, Kevin, the past does not matter. And when that person said that, I got so mad, so angry back when I was younger. I got so mad. How can you say that when they did blah, 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 when this happened here? How can you say that? Erase 18 years within one sentence. How can you say that? And I was so mad. Even before I gave my life to God or I was on my path to God, if I did not do things right with my parents, almost every single time something bad would happen to me, I am telling you. And I caught on after a while. Of course, even when I caught on, I still <laughs> tried to do my own thing, but I could not deny that some of the bad things that were happening to me because of how I was treating my parents or the attitude and the hatred that I had for them. So even though I did not want to be in contact with them or say anything to them or be around them, from the bad things that was happening to me and because I wanted to serve God as well, I had to change my attitude toward them. I had to associate with them much more. And even still to this day, I believe God have been... <laughs> ah. For instance, <laughs> maybe a week 
or early this week and last week as well for months I believe the Holy Spirit, God, whoever you want to call it, was pushing me to tell my parents that I loved them. Now, I love them, but to say it feels really, really weird. And this thought have been coming to me more and more and more. But I did not want to say it because I probably can count how many times from my teenage years till now, how many times <laughs> I said I love you to my parents. Not too many. And I can see that My point is, what you need to do is try to reconnect with your parents. I know that you may feel some type of way about them. I understand that. But I believe that God is trying to do something. You want to make sure that you are not holding any unforgiveness within yourself for those enemies that you have, your parents. Now, <laughs> this may be hard for you, especially how hard it was for me. You should tell your parents that you love them. Even if you feel like they don't deserve you saying that to them. Say it to them anyway. So I pray that this makes sense. You want to make sure that you forgive everyone. Because you don't want to die, then stand before God and have to answer him why you still have hatred for your parents. Wouldn't it be very crazy to be sent to hell forever because you could not forgive your parents? Like being burnt alive and tortured all day, every day because you could not forgive your parents. Let's say that your parents would beat you five days a week. I can understand how a person can I can understand how a person can hate their parents in that instance, but it is wrong. But why would you want to hold unforgiveness for your parents, then be sent to hell and be tormented worse than what your parents did to you? I know for myself, I don't like pain. And if a person came to me, Kevin, you can experience this level 10 pain or this level five pain. Which one do you want? First, I would say none. <laughs> but if I have to pick, give me the lowest amount of pain. So yes, your parents may have done very bad things to you, but it is better to forgive than to be sent to hell and be tormented worse than what happened to you on this earth. I pray that this makes sense. God bless you.